All right, guys, we're going to pay going outdoors at the um, Free Counties Bushcraft um, Social Meet this weekend. So, it's set up in the dark, being Friday evening, so, um, literally, not much to show really. By the time we set up and sort of around the fire, um, one of the members cooked up a, a wicked tie, um, prawn and chicken. Um, curry, which was absolutely beautiful, and just sort of chilling around the fire, um, and uh, take the mickey out with you as you do. Um, most of it definitely not be that be allowed on YouTube, but, um, but yeah, no, it's been a cracking evening. So I've just done the old hot chocolate and a couple of bickies. So I thought I'd sort of get this done before I forget, so it's not too, I guess it's not overly cold, not much of a breeze to be fair, I'm in a flower point shelter, um, because I'm sort of quite close to the car, I bought me bed chair with me, the fishing bed chair, so I'm in that with a modular free season bag and wall blanket just over the top in case of any condensation in the morning, I'll show you the, the full setup in the daylight but um, I don't anticipate being cold or anything I've even bought um, my uh, remembered actually my little tea light UCO light this time so I've got that going in the background for a little sort of bit of ambient light a bit of flicker so uh, if I spin you around yeah because you got that there a little light chair, then behind that, you can see the parachute there um, with a few tilly lanterns up, and um, the guys, uh, I can't see it around this tree, but yeah, we've got the guys sort of pretty much behind that tree under the parachute chatting. Sure, you can hear them, but yeah, it's uh, it's been a good one. So, I've got me and Bernard here, so he's in his hammock. Um, but yeah, I thought I'd have a bit of a change of setup, so uh, let's see how that goes. So, yeah, no, it's been a, been a cool evening. So, what I'll do is I'll get back to you guys in the morning, hopefully, or at some point during the day anyway. So I'll right, catch you later. Hi right, guys, it's a Saturday morning. I do while it's a bit quiet around camp while well, a few are out getting some wood. I thought I'd show you a bit around so I'll spin you around. There we go, so this is our main sort of seating area. Got the big old parachute. Got a few seats around at the moment. You've got fire wood store there. So got some logs around the outside. Got any fishing chairs, big coal box, brews, the old uh, an awesome pressure cooker. I always say it's Turkish, but it's not, I can't remember what it is now. Pakistan, I think. Pressure cooker, absolutely wicked. But yeah, we've got um, any oil lamps, a few setups over there. So, yeah, this is our main sort of cooking seating area of a the night. There's a new camping man ready to do the salt course. <laughs> I'll walk you over to, there's my son's rig, the uh, 4x4 Coty Brown Amok, he's fast to kip. Um, this is a different setup for me for a change, the old plough point. So, I'll spin you around the outside first. So, against the tree, pegged down, pulled out at the back. 
and had to use that because there was no trees available. A bit slack at the back, but it doesn't matter. So yeah, I'll do. So we got that way. So got him remembered me UK tea light candle this time. And I've got bed chair, free season bag, wool blanket. That was too hot for the wool blanket last night. Packing that behind the back. Birthday cake. Be the table. So yeah, so that's my setup. Hey guys, so I had a slight interruption. A few other people turned up at camp, so I had to do the uh, the old handshake jobs. This is the old woodland we got. That's the, this is the view from my setup. So at camp. So yeah, as I say, got the old storm in Norman. Every table set up, some head torches, and just gear stowed. He ran underneath the bed chair or in the main bag at the back. So, tons of room. So, if I wanted to, I could proper uh, move back a bit more if the weather really come in from a weird angle. But, put my little USB torch there, lantern there. But, and uh, this little, my little UK one I've not used for a while. So, lovely little ambient light to look at when it's uh, in the dark. Yeah, absolutely cracking. Lovely place for a camp. Alright, I'll crack you guys later on. Morning guys, Thank you. Uh, Sunday morning, so really good last, last night, a few beers, so weren't too bad at all to be fair, so uh, yeah, a bit of a, I don't know, spin you around, a bit of a murky morning, but I'll give you a little spin round, so yeah, a little bit. Grim out, but it don't look too bad. Uh, up around camp, I mean, these lot have been up since about seven o'clock, so milling around the fire. Uh, it's Sunday morning, so I'm sort of staying in my pit. But, uh, yeah, I'll be. Uh, just be getting out in a bit and starting to pack down. Oh, nearly nine o'clock, I think. 
So, yeah, that's no, it's been a cracking weekend. Um, we had a, a family come over yesterday, stayed the night in their big uh, hot tent. Uh, set up a massive zip line yesterday for the kids to go on, so that was cool. And some other people come over for the day. So, generally, really, really busy, so... Yeah, it was a it was a cracking time. So really, um, really good fun. So already looking forward to March's camp, which I think um, is going to be a bit of a. Um, I think they're trying to try and get all our old gear out, stuff that we ain't used for forever, all the really old school gear. So. Um, See what everyone brings. But yeah, no, it's been a bit of a cracking weekend. Um, it's not been too bad, to be fair. So, um, a lot of uh, the kids were getting taught firelighting yesterday, flint and steel, um, and whatnot, and bringing like a bird's nest to flame and stuff. So, all the kids were really enjoying that. So it's cool sort of teaching them, but so I didn't do much filming yesterday because we did have, I think in the end, I think we had about 10, 11 kids um, come over with parents and stuff. So I couldn't really sort of film sort of with them around as such because of um, being on film and stuff like that uh, nowadays. So. But um, yeah, a cracking day. Had a big. I'll put some pictures up on this video. I had a lovely, uh, big chunky vegetable stew, sort of soup dash stew type thing with uh, tiger bread and that. That was a cracking meal. So a few beers and stuff. Um, but yeah, no, a cracking weekend all told. So. And also my birthday weekend, so we had me chocolate birthday cake and all the rest of it. So that was cool. Um, but yeah, so in a minute I'll be getting out of my pit and pack, doing a slow pack up, get sorted. And all the gear in the car and off home. So um, I don't do any more filming before I leave. Thank you for watching. Uh, if you want to like and subscribe, please do so. Um, love and light, and I'll catch you on the next one, guys. So, see you later.